Good morning, hot dogs. Homecoming winners, College Go Week, and more after the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. This week is College Go Week, so make sure you dress up. Tomorrow's theme is military or trade profession. Wednesday is college roommates or dress up as twins. Thursday is, is dress up like a boss or dress for success. And finally, Friday is your future starts here, so wear your Frankfurt gear. In continuing with College Go Week, there are currently 40 colleges that have waived their application fee. If you are interested for applying for college, please check out the list in the chatter. If you are considering attending FAFSA night, you must make an appointment before October 3rd. If you need to make an appointment, call or email Esmeralda Cruz. FAFSA night will take place on Thursday, October 6th. And now we'll t send it over to Sports and Weather. What's up, dogs? Do you want to get, get in the best shape of your life? Do you want to go fast in water? Go try out for the swim team. FHS Swim and Dive is having an official call out on Friday, the 30th, after school in room 203. No experience needed. And in their final home game, the boys soccer team played for the conference title. Alex Castro scored the first goal of the half and only goal. Keepers Jose Campos and Noe Angeles made key saves and only allowing one goal. The hot dogs played hard and maintained most of the possessions while limiting tri West to very few chances. And in the second half, Manuel Berrigan got the goal, got the go-ahead goal to make it 2-1. About 10 minutes later, Alex Castro scored a second goal of the game and gave Frankfurt a more comfortable two-goal lead. And Manuel Berrigan put the game out of reach by scoring a second by scoring a second of the half, putting the hot dogs up three, beating Tri-West four to one to become your 2022 Sagamar Conference champs. Now to Cindy. Good morning, dogs. Today we have a high of 65 degrees and a low of 41. Things are starting to feel very cold lately from last week and the week before. So make sure to wear a jacket or any type of clothing to keep yourself warm. That's it for weather. Now let's send back to Carlos for more sports. Thanks, Cindy. And the football team lost at home to a ranked Western Boone team. The defense made great improvements this week as they held Weebo's running backs to under 100 yards for the first time this season. The JV continued their trend of constant improvement this week. The defense forced two turnovers and made some great physical tackles. The offense is starting to come together with these guys filling new roles. And the girls cross country team placed seventh and the boys team placed fifth in the gold division at the Golden Bear Invitational. The top girl finishers were Ashley Vasquez Rivera, in 25th place out of 75 runners in the division. Her time of 22 minutes tied her for the 14th fastest time in school history. Two boys made the podium. Chris Angeles was second place and Angel Perez was fifth out of 103 runners in the division. That's all for sports, now back to your host. Thanks, Carlos. A huge congratulations goes out to this year's homecoming court winners, Jenny Garcia and Nelson Honor. And a congratulation goes out to the juniors for winning the hallway decoration contest and sophomores for winning the float contest. Also, a huge thank you to all our class sponsors and representatives that has helped out the past two weeks. And a happy birthday goes out to Nathan Guzman. And as well, for lunch today, lines one and two is chicken alfredo, lines three is cheese crunchers, and lines four is assorted flatbread pizza. And that's all for today, dogs. Make sure you like and subscribe. And I hope to see you next time. Deuces.